Mr. President, what will you do if Iran deploys silkworm missiles? Nothing? Don't answer that one. Do you really want the Russians in the Persian Gulf? You won't answer that. Well, okay, how was the bed? Huh? How was the bed? How was the... The bed! The bed? The bed? The bed? The big bed. Just fine. Oh, you answered that one. <laughs> I never fail. Mr. President, are we just bluffing when we warn Iran not to deploy those silkworm missiles? I haven't bluffed once since I've been here. So, so it's a real uh, threat against Iran, sir? No, it's just a statement of fact. Will you lift some of the sanctions against the Japanese, Mr. President? Yeah, I am. I'm all the way up. But I'm, I'm getting sound. Hey, Steve.
enjoyed it very much. best place for a meeting, I think I'd rather have to look out the window. <laughs> Two waves of press. We're ready. Do the Soviets play any constructive role in the Persian Gulf? Mr. Prime Minister, why won't Italy give the United States help in ships in keeping that Gulf open? We're here to talk about everything. Lights, please. Mr. President, why aren't you going in the front way tomorrow instead of the side door when there's the opening of the meeting? <laughs> Sam, that's one question I'll answer. I just wait till somebody points me in the direction I'm supposed to go and I don't ask any questions about that. Sir, is it embarrassing for the leader of the free world to sneak in the side door when the others are going in the front? President, will you, will you give Mr. Will you give Mr. Stock Magasoni any reassurance on the sanctions this afternoon? We haven't had our meeting yet. Let's go. Strictly a security thing. All right, so they know something I don't know. <laughs> well, we enjoyed our lunch in Rome very much on Saturday. <coughs> in this very beautiful city, and I just want to congratulate you on all of the planning and the hospitality for this summer meeting. Now we're 15 minutes, it's going well. Let's see, see now what follows. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And uh, we're here just for this, to see that there is a good follow-up. Mm -hmm. 
The beginning is good and uh, we hope that the end will even be better. Statement. Um, we want a good statement on the Persian Gulf, and we're going to make some progress on terrorism. Bafani bought off on it until the last minute. I think it was coming over here on the boat. Andriotti weighed in and said, "Oh, we thought freedom of navigation uh, ought to be a UN matter, and uh, the last thing we need is the UN telling us what to do in the, in the Persian Gulf." So we're going to have to. They, they control the drafting. And Fanfani is reluctant to overrule uh, Andriotti, so Rogero doesn't know what to do, and he has left us with the responsibility of trying to straighten out what I thought Andriotti. What, what we wanted from the UN was, was the UN statement on ending the war. That's exactly right. Plus compulsory sanctions. compulsory sanctions. And we've all been saying that publicly, and that's, George has uh, been doing a, a good job on that. We don't want a UN flotilla in the Persian Gulf. Yeah. Uh, it, it's a cop out. Andrew, as I told you the other day, had made some unhelpful statements. He, uh, he is against the Italians uh, supporting us in the Persian Gulf. We're just confronting it basically in agreement with us. I think you should know that on the way from the helicopter, Sam Donaldson shouted as usual as a question. The question had to do with, you know, what we were going to do in the Gulf, and what would we? Uh, and I said, I can't answer the question. I won't answer the question. And he then said, Well, are we bluffing? Are you bluffing? And I said, I haven't bluffed once since I've been here. Pointed in. They're both Flow teller. Which one is cold? I guess that. He's probably in the middle there somewhere. Size of them, it's probably the one that's deepest in the water. Now, <laughs> <laughs> no. Just like George Murphy said about. Uh, yeah, it looks like the one with the most blue suits in it. Yeah. He could be down below there. Yeah, probably down below so they get wet. Yeah, that one. There he is. And that is no. 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 Tax fine. 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 Tax fine.
There he is. There he is. There he is. Well, they got a lot of people in there. Yeah. Like one of those little black circuits where they have a Volkswagen. <laughs> <laughs> I won't make the other the rest of the analogy. <laughs> yes, though. <laughs> Hello, Please welcome. Well, it's good to see you. Yeah, yeah. How are you doing? Mr. Chancellor Howard Baker. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. How are you? Nice to see you. How are you? Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Something like that. Mauvish, isn't it? Little man's style. I wonder how old it is. I'm so Venice was a very interesting place, and he said, Yes, it's great if you have lots of money and lots of time. But this is so good. If you're really not bluffing, uh, is deployment of those missiles in uh, Iran enough to justify a U.S. reaction? Uh, Sam, I can't talk about things like that, uh, and I'm not going to. You're really not bluffing. Uh, you're really uh, not bluffing. <laughs> I tried to fool someone the other day about my ignorance about Venice. We flew over in a helicopter. And when I got out, I said to some people, I said, they must have had a terrible rainstorm here because all the streets are flooded and I've got boats in the streets. And I couldn't fool me, but I believe. I think just about getting that way now. We've been here a few days. And it's very warm and humid. Yes, it has been our, our time change is six hours. In Germany, it's new cold and very rainy. Well Mr. President, why should the Germans do more on the Persian Gulf? Because I bet you lost. Well, as a matter of fact, the climate is so nice there. Sam, <laughs> 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 Ich hoffe, dass mal was Freundliches Well, they may, they may use that. Well, they broadcast. And that's something kind, because this is rather unusual to say something, that they are saying something kind in their broadcast. So you are not angry about the Germans? <laughs> you are not angry about the Germans? Please. No. Very satisfied. Thank you. So. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
Ja, das war ein, der deutsche Bein. Das ist der deutsche Bein. Ich mag das Bein, weil er so schön ist. Ja. Hey, Frank, kann ich dich für einen Moment verlassen? So one of those will make the papers, don't you? That'll be, uh, I think you'll see that played in all the American papers, sure. As a matter of fact, I couldn't see them very clearly. It doesn't matter. I just thought, you know, I don't know who's going to be in this time. Could be Bill again, or could be Sam, or could be Andrea, or Chris Wallace. Hi, how are you? Hi. Uh, nice to meet you again. Good to see you again. Uh, many thanks for your kindness. Uh, you showed up during your stay in Washington this last time. Yeah. Nice to meet you again. Nice to see you again. Finance Minister. Hello. Hello. Thank you very much for your kind letter and passwords. Guess I'll see you again. Meeting Minister Tamara. Deputy Chief of the Cabinet Secretary, Congressman. Oh, so I can have MIT. Congressman, she is somehow tired and uh, she didn't come here this time. Uh, she is staying in Tokyo. Ah. Well, mine came with me, but this morning she left for Stockholm, Sweden. Oh, so. oh. <laughs> Some drug programs. Oh, she's always traveling during the summit meeting. Well, yes, Mr. President. You stand behind the light the other time, and I called you Sam, and I want you to know that the next time Sam asks me a question, I'm going to call him Bill. Thank you very much. In the meantime, sir, could you answer one? How about lifting some sanctions uh, on uh, Japan? Is that in the works? We haven't had our meeting yet. Do you think that might happen today? Can I bet on it? <laughs> Put your money in your pocket. How about a partial lifting of the sanctions? Uh, <laughs> you don't ask you questions that I can't answer before we have a meeting. <laughs> nice, please. Thank you. Yeah. Mr. 
and I must say they do sound alike. Well, you and I are alike. <laughs> more and more so. <laughs> During the 80 campaign, he was very professional. He received orders. That's right. That man I told you about in New York. That's right. Tells you to get that story out there today. I don't have to mind it. I'm going to keep <笑>最初にそうしましたけど、新聞ちゃんです。あの、散歩の散歩間違えて、ロバート。どうもありがとうございます。あ、ロンのポケットの中に何かあるんじゃないですか。Put the exact the same question. Any gift to any gift to the contestant? Uh, I can't answer that question. We haven't had our meeting yet. Mr. President, the virus is worldwide. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <coughs> 